Santos and Circuit, the low level light system, following the light along the aisle. 500 series aircraft. We ask that you watch and listen carefully. Your seat belt is fastened, and your seat belt is fastened. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Actually, uh, yeah, there is a channel, but this is like I think it's like the first of these kinds of videos. I'm not so sure which one comes out first because I did like a few in Nigeria. Basically, I try to get some of my perspective as I travel to places. So right now I'm in Accra, and yeah, for those of you who don't know, it's capital of Ghana and yeah it's been an interesting stay so far i've been at the marriott hotels it's kind of nice really nice i'll show you some of the things here yeah, you see all of those Accra has been quite interesting. I've noticed a few things. I'm not going to take much of your time. Um, first thing I like to talk about is that you can drive for so long in Accra and never really hear people honking like how you hear in Nigeria. Nigeria is my reference because that's where I live. So it was quite surprising for me and impressive as well. I was recording an interview earlier and you know that was helpful because we were recording in a place where you know had like a glass that was directly facing the street and you know that in audio the um, frequency of honking is really really um, sensitive so yeah so that that was really good i think that was brilliant because in nigeria every second you hear pam, 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 it's almost like music you know and all of that so that's really good at crack keep it up and yeah i like that but on the other side of things, I think the roads in Accra is really, really small. I think they need to be expanded. I don't know what the government is going to do about it, but like there's like crazy traffic situation. And I estimate that if nothing is done, then in like maybe six, five years from now, or ten, or maybe even sooner, there's going to be like crazy. Accra will be like a crazy traffic zone, especially I think the closing hour or in the mornings are better, but like later on say from like five six seven eight you know you just get stuck in a lot of places overall i've enjoyed my stay here i tried in terms of food i tried the red red although i ate it in a hotel so but then it was really nice so i don't know what it tastes like i, I didn't get to taste it from the streets i also went to labadi beach and it was really nice we went in the night i didn't really do videos you know just chilled uh, but it was really nice. I, I look forward to going to there again. Yeah, they were built by the Dutch. Oh, and, wow. And they left and they handed it over to the British. Oh, wow. I didn't know that part of the history. Yeah. You said what was built by the Dutch. Wow. So they, call, they also called us at Oka. That's where they started. Yeah. I really like it. It's. Uh, it's so like I said, a lot of Accra reminds me of Abuja, but that Jamestown is is it has a vibe, it has a feeling. Oh, they and have I love uh, it. this uh, festival in Orchard. Oh, that's where they did it. I also went to Jamestown, which I really like. They have this very, you know, it has this very old style, you know, feeling, and I think that was really good on the camera. Uh, um, no wonder why Files shot his video. I think that song is called Girls in, in Jamestown. And by the way, I met these guys who tried to hustle me and <laughs> it was quite an interesting episode. But we had a great conversation eventually and it turned out pretty well. And then we left, well, I took pictures at the lighthouse and yeah, I had a great time. So um, at this point, I'm just gonna say thank you so much for watching and I will be bringing you more interesting videos and I'm gonna get better as we go. Um, just like the video, share, subscribe, drop a comment, you know, and see you next time.